Do you see that the behaviors of the younger generation, and you were talking about these emotional connect uh, to the drama, they will, do you see that they will want to be more immersed into the story to make it interesting? Right? And that's what Gus will probably be talking about. They will want to be part of the storylines and then as if they are inside the story. And there's a lot, a, a kind of a rising uh, technology of doing such. Yeah, no, I, I, I think, look, I think if this were 1966, all we'd be talking about is television. Now there are so many ways to entertain. I think gaming is a big part of it. I think all these other things, interactive is a part of it. You know, and it's it's a question of of the story, though. And, and it's all about the story. You can have all the gigaws and things and, and have a bad story, and I don't think it amounts to much. But yeah, I think we're going to get to a place. I saw, you know, I went to see a de demonstration of 3D television. It was extraordinary. You know, here, here's the thing. When I was in law school at Hastings, um, my friend, I had a friend named Bruce Garber that went and bought a Cadillac, which tells you something about Bruce, you know, which is kind of an odd thing for a law student to do. And, and so we, uh, we, drove, we drove up on top of Twin Peaks, and um, in those days, this is 1976, and in those days, car, it had a CB radio in it, because that's what cars had. It was like this fancy thing. And so he got his new Cadillac, we drive up on Twin Peaks, and he gets on his radio and he goes, can anybody hear me? He had nothing to say. He said, can anybody hear me? So you, get, you have 3D and you've got nothing compelling to put on it. It's like, hello, can you see me? You know, it's just like, so, so I think it's like, it's like everything to me, all the technology, all the effort comes back to the written word and the ability to entertain. And, and people can do it or people can not do it. And if you, if you, if you have a sound story, for example, that um, Jurassic Park is now out in 3D. A great story, a great movie can only be enhanced. A, a piece of direct movie in 3D is just a piece of direct you can see better. You know, so it's just, you know, so I, yeah, I'm not dismissive of technology. I think it's great. And, and I, think, I think technology, you know, there are going to be different instrumentalities of distribution, different platforms, all these different things to do. But there's got to be something to put on it that's a high quality, and we can debate what high quality is. But I think human beings, there are some, there are some through lines, and I think that mostly we can all spot quality when we see it. We know it entertains us, we know it emotionally, emotionally connects, whether it's a book or a film or a television show or a record, that some things are just, you know, you know it when you see it.